this is MakerJ101, and today I'm going to be making a alcohol lamp for basically free. So basically I'm just going to use a few cans like this. So why I'm doing this is because my other alcohol lamp, it's made out of glass, and when it gets hot up here, it cracks and all the stress and everything. So yeah, I need a new one. So I'm just going to use some cans, and basically what I did is I took the bottom of a can, well all of these are bottoms of cans, so you need three cans for this. Um, I poked a hole in it with a screwdriver and so that there's this junk sticking up. And then I took a piece of antenna tube and stuck that over top. It fits on there perfectly. And that's so that the flame is raised up a little bit and doesn't heat this up and conduct down and boil the um, alcohol that's going to be in there. And then I'm, I just took a piece of rope, cotton rope, and that's going to be my wick. You don't want it to, to be too tight through this hole, or else it won't be able to wick up very well. So, yeah, so now I'm just going to put my 100% alcohol in here. You could use 70 or 90, but you'll have to change it after a little while. You could use oil in this, but since I'm going to use it for my sterling engine, I'm going to use alcohol because it burns cleaner. So now you just stick the top on here. It's kind of hard to get the top on. Yep. And then your lid. So when you're not burning it, to keep the alcohol from evaporating. And I bent the um, sides over so it's not sharp. You really should do this to this too, but then you won't be able to get the lid on very well. So yeah, the lid fits right on there. So now we'll test it out. For some reason, my little high voltage transformer is not working. Not sure why. Huh, that's weird. I'll have to use matches there. It works. See, there's a nice flame on there. So you could burn oil with it, but alcohol is cleaner, so it's pretty hot. So now I can run my Sterling engine on that. That's about it. Thanks for watching. Okay, actually, um, my transformer is still working. It is just that I accidentally hooked my um, bench power supply, which has almost the same wires up to my power supply over here instead so I thought it wasn't working but I just had something else hooked up so yeah so it still works See, I don't know what it was from but it works it does a nice almost half inch long spark continuous and it's very compact too but I like it a lot I don't I think I found it somewhere I'm not really sure I don't remember but what I usually do with it is um, when the power where it goes out, um, I use it as a, I hook up a compact fluorescent light bulb. The base is, was burned out on this one, so I cut it off. And I just hook it straight up to the power supply. And I hook the 12 volt, because it runs off 12 volts, I can hook it up to a 6 amp hour battery, that's what I usually use with it. And it doesn't put out a lot of light, but it's very efficient and it'll run it for a good 24 hours at least on this with this much light output because it only draws about 100 milliamps maybe 200 I forget but yeah it doesn't draw very much and it's pretty bright I mean it's brighter than a few candles so yeah thanks for watching